everyone um i wanted to come on and post the video real quick it's not going to be long um i had a request of showing the christmas tree skirt that i did uh for my christmas tree here in my sewing room so i wanted to show you real quick and here it is and i wanted something different so I don't know what's wrong with this camera it is being crazy anyways um, I did the retro vans and I found this fabric at Walmart and I got every fat quarter that there was and I haven't seen any back so I thought um, this would be cute to do and then I backed it with the rainbow that I found. And this is just a tree skirt that I got from Dollar Tree. I traced the pattern, cut it out, and then um, did my own little tree skirt. And I was going to put some ties right here to tie, but I was like, you know what? It, I'm just going to throw it on there. And um, I used fusible fleece. And so I didn't do anything fancy with this. It, it, it's just something, you know, that I wanted just to, just simple to do. And so that's what I did. And so there it is. Now, um, I also on my embroidery machine, I did this candy cane. Um, it's a free design on Creative Kiwi. And so I did that to go on the tree and it really didn't take really no time to do and I thought it was a quick simple design so I did that um, here is my grandbaby's little Christmas stocking um, I'm gonna put little stuff in here but I also did the big one for him and this is what I did and I didn't do a loop on it I may go back and put a loop on there but um, it was just something I did and I thought it was cute little snowman all the little stuff so that's his um, I still got to work on both of my other grandbabies Christmas stocking and I haven't finished that yet and let's see um my daughter's bowl cozies i did let's see this is supposed to be the outer part in the trucks and so i did her two of them and then i did the other one in um Frosty the Snowman. So they're going to get that for Christmas. And so that's what I've been working on. And then another thing that I have worked on is I got this book at Walmart. And in this magazine, I did these. Little mini scissor holders. If you have a Walmart, feel free to go pick up this book. It's got um, some good stuff in here. Um, I do want to make this right here. I do want to make that. And, uh, and it's a stitch along. So, I was thinking about... Um, whoever wanted to stitch with me um they do have a video on youtube and it's american patchworks quilting and it is a free pattern and so with the instructions and so i figure if somebody wanted to do this with me let me know um leave me comments or or something below 
I don't know. I'll let you know when I'm going to start this. But I will, anybody that wants to do it with me, let me know. You could go get your own free pattern and it'll, I'm going to try to see if it's going to be doing in one or two parts so it won't be so long. I don't, I'm not sure. I'm going to go watch the video on how it's constructed. But yeah, I figure that would be a great sew along for someone that wants to do it with me. If not, you can do it on your own. Like I said, it's a free pattern on um, on that. So um, I thought it would be a quick little organizer. You can make it into a needle book or how whatever you want to use it for. And um, here is the little um, scissor keepers that I did. And uh, you do felt and then the inside part's fabric. And then I'm thinking about doing a video on how to make these. Uh, it's on the pattern. So I'll probably just do a video how I make them. But if you want to pick up this book, it, it is your local Walmart. And uh it's issue 173 and it's got a bunch of cute stuff in here i love this gift wrap quilt right here which i think it's very darling and um i want to do this And so I'm kind of working on that right now. I've got the letters cut out and I need to decide whether or not um, I might do it with fabric and I don't know how I'm gonna work it, but I'm gonna work it. So, but anyway, I just kind of wanted to give you a little heads up on what um, I'm doing. Another thing is I made a little mini ironing board right here. And you wouldn't want to know what I made this out of. Um, you know, I work at Dollar General. And so, um, we have these boards. It's in the craft section. And they're frames. And up on top, you know, it's just a wooden frame. Nothing fancy. And anyways, that's what I made my little mini um, ironing board. And, um... Yeah, I thought that was pretty nifty. And so it works, let me tell you. And so um, I'm going to be putting together a, um, a sewing bag. Just putting a sewing bag together, you know, little odds and ends. So I've got some ideas that I'm coming up with. Um... So therefore, I just wanted to put this video out. I know it's quick, but that's all right. So I just wanted to reach out to everybody. Thank you for all the subscribers that's come to my channel. Please like and comment below and ring that bell and when you'll get notified of when I do other videos. I'm sorry this is a short video, but I wanted to um, post that tree skirt so that way she can see it. And um, I told her that I would do a video on it. Okay, guys. Y'all take care and I will see y'all back again. All right, bye-bye.